Hi and welcome to another uh, training session here with the H plus one 3D printer from Affinity 3D. Uh, today we're going to be talking about how to print from a USB drive with a TSK file or to uh, print from saved files on the printer itself. Uh, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to go to our Affinity Studio 3D software uh, which we have uh, gone over the operation uh, here of the software. Uh, so let's just jump right into our task for today. And uh, first thing I want to do is just make sure is that our printer uh, material type is going to match the same uh, uh, material type that's going to be on the printer itself. I'm actually attached to the printer right now uh, via our local uh, local area network and uh, so it's reading in this information already so I'm all set to go. Click close and uh, so let's go ahead and add an STL file and we've got that uh, uh, loaded in right now. So then our next step is to go to the print settings. Um, choose your parameters here. These parameters look uh, okay to me. And so we'll go to the preview screen. And here uh, I'm going to just click save file. And I'm going to get to my USB drive and I've got a folder for TSK files and this is what it's going to be saving as as a TSK file it's a task file so I'm going to click save give it a second here to finish and I'm going to go ahead and exit out of the preview and open up my folder and there it is right there so I'm ready to jump off here and we'll get into the printer itself so let me change over to our webcam and we're gonna go ahead and pop out our USB drive and get over to the interface of our printer. Just below the interface there's a USB slot. Go ahead and plug into there. Give it a second to mount the drive then we'll go to print and USB. Now the green files here, the, the green, these are the folders. I don't know if you can tell this color. They'll have little plus signs in front of the words. And uh, we can hit the uh, other pages. So in as they uh, go from green to blue, these are actually files, t TSK files that we could load in. So I'm going to open up my TSK fo files folder, and here is the Affinia Bearing TSK file that we created. I'm going to click there. It's going to show some of the parameters that we saved it as. So it's got the uh, layer height of 0.25, material PLA, uh, the weight and time estimate and uh, from here I can go ahead and click if I clicked add it would add it to the memory in the, the printer itself so that I could come back and just print it multiple times from any as long as it's in the memory um, otherwise I can just hit print and from here it's basically just like we've printed from our software itself you can see that the software is actually giving us uh, the information as well that is printing and this is how you print from a task file. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and stop this by hitting pause, hit the stop button, confirm I want to stop printing. Alright, now let's just go back uh, into print and this is the history of the files that are on here. So if I select one of these, uh, this is all the information uh, for this that was printed on the system. And I can reprint it from here. Um, if I want to clear this out, I can hit delete here. I can uh, um, see the, all of the history all together. 
I can clear the history out of the system if I wanted to do that. Um, so uh, go back here and that's how you print from a file uh, that's on the system. This was a uh, bit of a shorter video but uh, hopefully it helps you and uh, as always uh, good luck with 3D printing. Thank you.